stand at the front of your mat. And again, just take a moment as always. So you don't often start the practice standing straight away. So just take a moment to arrive here. As always, just close down the eyes. The feet can be hip distance apart. Just connect to the ground, notice the feet on the ground. You can lift through the toes, so you're finding that placement through the feet, that connection. And relax through the shoulders. You can bring your toes back down if you haven't already. Soften again through the knees. So when we lift our toes, everything tends to switch on through the front of the body just to stop us from toppling over. So just find a little bit of softness. So again, that rooting down, but that lifting up. Relax through the arms, through the face. And we're going to take three cleansing breaths here. So as we breathe in, bring the shoulders all the way up to the ears. As you breathe out, drop the shoulders down and back. And again, breathing in. Breathing out. One more, breathe in. Breathing out. Slowly open the eyes, wiggle the toes, soften through the knees, breathe in, reach the arms all the way up, palms come to touch, breathe out, folding all the way down, soften through the knees, really bend through those knees this morning, just take a moment in a forward fold, find some real softness here, especially early on in the practice, get a little bit of movement in the head. That deep flowing breath. Inhale, halfway lift. Take your hands all the way up to your thighs. Exhale, fold back down. Two more. Inhale, hands trace all the way up to the thighs. Flat back. Exhale, folding back down. One more, breathe in, rolling up through the spine, halfway lift. Exhale, folding back down, soften through the knees, inhale, reach the arms all the way up. Exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, reach. Exhale, fold. Half lift. Folding back down. Inhale, reaching all the way back up. Exhale, hands to heart. Two more of those. Inhale, reach. Maybe look up to the thumbs. Exhale, folding forwards. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale to fold. Inhale to rise. Exhale, hands to heart. Let's do one more. Inhale, take up space. Folding forwards. Catch a wave. Take that breath all the way up, halfway lift. Exhale, folding back down. Inhale, root to rise. Exhale, hands to heart. Release the hands down. Inhale, reach. Interlace the fingers. Turn the palms away from you so the palms are facing up towards the ceiling. Take length through both sides of the body. Maybe just see if you can bring the arms a little bit further back now towards the ears so the upper arms are in line with the ears. So don't force anything, but just that intention there. 
Exhale, lean to the right, hips to the left. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, lean to the left, hips to the right. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, break free with the hands. Forward front. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, folding down, planting the hands, stepping both feet back. Coming into plank pose, strong, push away from the floor. Maybe shifting forward and back. And then coming into your plank, lower the knees down, chest and chin lower, hips are high. Inhale, sliding through cobra. Exhale, folding back down. Tucking the toes, pushing back up onto knees, rolling through the spine, coming into our first downward dog. Take a moment here just to stretch through those legs, pedal the feet. So get any movement through the body here that you need. You can really bend into those knees and then pushing that other heel to the ground so you're really starting to stretch from side to side. And then find some softness as you come to pause in this pose, just relax through the shoulders, draw the shoulders away from the ears, elbows. So if you're trying to sort of tug the elbows down to the ground, navel draws up to the spine. You can have bent knees. Take another breath. And soften through the knees, look forward and make your way up to the front of your mat. Coming back to our forward fold, halfway lift, folding back down, inhale, reach the arms all the way up, exhale, hands to heart, into the legs, inhale, reach the arms all the way up, exhale, lean to the right, inhale, coming back to centre, Exhale, lean to the left. Inhale, back to centre. Exhale, break three, folding forwards. Halfway lift. Folding back down. Planting the hands again, step back into plank. Strong plank. Take a breath. Lower knees, chest and chin, hips are high. Pause here. Feel that stretch and then slide through into cobra. Inhale. Exhale, folding back down. Curl the toes under, either push back onto knees or up to plank. And moving back into your downward dog. Take a breath. Notice already in this down dog, maybe you have a bit more legs here. Just sway those hips from side to side. And then again, just finding some stillness. Drawing through those fingertips, paying attention to the palm of the hands. You start to dome through the palm just slightly, looking after those wrists. Exhale fully, bend the knees and make your way up to the front of your mat, forward fold. Half lift, folding back down, soften through the knees, inhale reaching all the way up, exhale hands to heart, into the legs, push the palms away, and up, inhale, exhale to the right, inhale back to center, exhale to the left, inhale back to center, exhale break free, half lift, inhale, 
Exhale to fold. Plant the hands, step back into brace. Full breath here, push away with the hands. So you're really starting to push the shoulders up, chest up towards the back. This time you can lower knees or chaturanga all the way down to the belly. Come on to the top of the feet. Inhale, roll back, cobra. Exhale, folding back down. Lifting the knees and coming back through plank. Exhale, arrive in your down dog. Take a breath. Wiggle through the head. And then finding some stillness here. Rolling forward into plank pose. Bringing the right hand into the center. Trust. You're going to slowly roll over onto your right foot. And if you need to bring this left foot to the ground, do. Reach that left arm up so you can modify here. Side plank, so feel free to be here. Strong in this right arm, building strength. You can take full side plank, lifting those hips. Maybe reaching the arm above the head. Take a breath. Exhale, coming back. Reach those hips back, downward dog. Again, taking a breath. Accept, notice. How did that side plank feel? I'm going to go on to the other side. So just moving through, coming into our plank pose. Don't think too much about it. Bringing the left hand into the center, rolling the hips to the left, reaching right arm up, maybe stacking the feet or stepping that right foot to the ground so you can have that support there. Maybe the right hands reach up over the head, lifting the hips. Take another breath. You are strong. Exhale, coming back. Downward facing dog. Full breath. Soften through the knees, looking forward, stepping forward. Forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale to fold. Inhale, reach the arms all the way up. Exhale, hands to heart. Interlace, push the palms away. Inhale, strong. Have that lift, that lift up through the ribs. Exhale to the right. Inhale to center, exhale to the left. Inhale to center, exhale, break free. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale to flop. Planting the hands, stepping both feet back into plank. Strong here. Exhale, downward facing dog. Take a breath. Just start to shake the head gently. Just a little bit of movement here. Walk the feet a little bit wider. You can move them a little bit closer towards the hands as well if you want to shorten the stance. From here, you're going to lift the right hand, look forward slightly, so we're starting to switch on the tummy. Exhale, reach the right hand towards the left leg, so the outside, the ankle, the shin. Use that to anchor, looking underneath the left armpit. Full stretch, breathing deep. Coming back, placing the right hand down, lifting those hips, down dog. Our oh, nice wide dog here. Inhale, lift the left leg. So just hover, look forward slightly, and then bring that left hand 
back to the outside of the right leg, wherever you can hold on. So your choice, stretching, trying to anchor through the feet. Take a breath, looking underneath that upper arm. Coming back to our dog, walk the feet back. Moving into plank, push away from the floor. Exhale, lowering down, either belly to cobra or upward dog. Take a choice here, so just notice how this feels. Exhale, lower the knees, shift the hips back, and we're going to take a child's pose. So allow those shoulders to drop to round forward, just softening through the hands. You can wiggle the fingertips here, just take a breath. Just resetting. Feeling that energy through the body. Reaching the hands forward, coming up on two knees. Hands underneath the shoulders, knees underneath the hips. Again, just pushing away. So we start to dove through that upper back slightly. Just awareness through the body here. Full breath. Send the left foot behind you. Send the right fingertips forward, hovering tables. So just stay here for a moment. If you need to adjust, do. Navel draws up towards the spine. Try to see if you can keep one long line. Take another breath here. And as we exhale, we're going to bend the elbow. The elbow comes out to the side at shoulder height. And we're going to bend the knee and bring that out to the side. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, bend. So it's almost like the arm and the leg are mirroring. Exhale. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, draw that navel in. So they're coming out to the side, not together. Two more. Inhale, lengthen, bring the right hand down to the floor. And from here, we're just going to sweep the left toes over towards the right. Push away with the hands again, and then look over that right shoulder towards the right side of the mat, looking at the toes. And then sweep the left leg all the way out to the left side, toes come down. Bring the toes to the floor. Bring your right hand out slightly. Inhale, take the left arm up. So just taking a stretch here. Full breath. Maybe reaching the left hand over the head, your choice. And then making our way back. Left hand comes down, right hand comes down. Bring that left knee back. Inhale, cow pose. Exhale, rounding through into cow. Two more. Move with your breath. And moving on to the other side. Exhale into cat. And then coming back to that neutral spine. Send the right foot behind you. Find that awareness first. And then send the left arm. Strong. Exhale, cactus that arm. Bring the knee out to the side. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, bend. Inhale, lengthen. 
Exhale, bend. Inhale. Exhale, using that exhale to just draw that belly in. Two more. Strong, building strength, waking up this morning. Last one. Bring this left hand down, send the right foot behind you, and then bringing that right foot over towards the left side. Push away from the floor, looking over that left shoulder. Take a full breath. And then sliding that right leg all the way out to the right side now. Bring the left hand down. Inhale, reach the right arm up. And maybe over the head, your choice. And stay here, you can even bring it to the lower back and just roll the shoulder back, opening up. So just decide, full breath. Exhale, bring that hand back, bring the other hand back and then slide the right knee back. Curl the toes under, reach the hands forward, downward facing dog. Take a moment to pedal through here. Full breath. Bend the knees, looking forwards, stepping forwards, forward fold. Really softening through these knees. Now start to drop the hips down. As low as you feel they can come here. Keeping the toes and the heels on the ground. Inhale, sweep those arms up. Coming into our Ukatasana. Navel draws back. Full breath. Inhale, lift as you do. Lift the left, arm up, uh, left knee up. One legged Tadasana. And then we're going to cross the left ankle over the right knee, making sure we have awareness in this left foot. Sorry, so left ankle over right knee. And then exhale, just sit down, sink those hips down, flexing through that left foot. Maybe keeping these arms reaching up. Strong. Trust. Inhale, rise. Exhale, send the left foot behind you, bringing the hands to the heart, coming into a warrior three variation here. Try to keep this left leg level with the hips, toes facing down. Inhale, step that left foot back, reach the hands up. Exhale, hands come down. And from here, we're going to rock the hips and step the left foot up to meet the right forward foot. Soften through the knees, draw the legs together. Hips come down as low as is comfortable. And then inhale, sweep those arms up. Ukatasana, chair pose, right here. Navel draws in, strong. Drawing those legs towards each other. As we inhale, lifting the arms, lift that right leg, reach one legged Tadasana. And then softening to that left knee as you cross the right ankle over the left knee, flexing through that right foot. And then start to sink the hips down. Our balancing chair here. So take a moment. Really reaching with those hands. Navel draws back. Maybe the hips sink a little bit lower. Inhale, lift, release that right leg. Bring the hands to the heart. Send the right foot behind you. Warrior three. The toes turn down, lifting through the navel. A little bend in that left knee. And then trust, really bend into that left knee to send the right foot behind you. Inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, hands come down to the floor. This time, step the left foot back. 
down dog and then roll through the spine to plank and move through your vinyasa. Feet to the back and I'll down the dog. Take a breath. One more here. Exhale, lower the knees down. And just shift back by the taking our traditional child pose. Knees wide. Or feel free to reach those hands forward, keeping the hips lifted. Heart to earth pose. So the hips are lifted here in this puppy posture sort of variation here. So my forearms are lifted too, but feel free to bring them down to the ground if you want to. And through the top of the feet, we're gonna take three breaths here. Slowly making your way up, walking your knees in, and then you can either cross through the ankles or send the hips to one side. We're going to come over into a seat. So just arrive here, relax through those shoulders. Inhale, reach the arms up. Take the right hand to the left knee, left hand comes behind you, open up through your chest, breathing in. Breathing out to release, inhale, reach the arms up. Twisting to the right, left hand down, right hand behind you, roll those shoulders back, chest open. Take a breath. Exhale, release. Come back into our seat, our Sukhasana. Bringing the palms to face up. Just take a moment in it. Arms, shoulders, hands. Relax. Hips. Your seat, your sitting bones. Rooted. That length through the spine. Tuck the chin just slightly. Feeling strong and powerful. What a wonderful day to start today. Notice how that short flow can iron out those creases and give us that boost of energy that perhaps we need. Take one more cleansing breath here. Breathe in through the nose. Breathe out through the mouth. Bring your hands together at your heart. Gently bowing head to hands. From me to you, have a wonderful day. Namaste.